very much for staying with us this afternoon. In fact, our top story, it's been 48 hours since a 34-year-old woman was killed by electrocution near New Delhi railway station. This, as she tried to avoid water logging near the parking and came in contact with a loose wire. The national capital is still in shock over the young mother's death. Delhi cops have filed a case of death due to negligence, but not named anyone in the FIR, and no one has been arrested yet. Meanwhile, the NHRC has issued notices to the Railway Board, Delhi Chief Secretary and the Police Commissioner over the incident. In fact, the recent incident in Delhi has exposed shoddy and makeshift approach to managing safety in public spaces, especially around stations. Railways has ordered a safety audit post the incident. Times Network conducted a reality check at the busiest railway stations around the country to highlight safety dark spots. Right now I'm at the old Delhi railway station and we did a reality check out here. Now in the old Delhi railway station situation is comparatively better than the new Delhi railway station. Though if you talk about railway stations in the national capital which is the capital of the country, uh, you feel that the railway stations would be completely high tech. Uh, let me show you the pictures out here. This is the old Delhi railway station. Now there are no open wires but the wires here actually at the old Delhi railway station are in a very poor condition which needs uh, immediate attention from the railway authority. Now, the railway have stated that they would uh, 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 check all the electrical installation, the audits would be done as soon as possible to make sure there is no open wires. Now, the question is, every year before the monsoon hits the national capital, this particular electrical uh, uh, audit check of the electrical institution should be done immediately to make sure that this sort of incident does not happen. Now, the major question arises is that whether the railway can guarantee that this sort of incident would not repeat again, uh, whether they would make sure that all the open wires or the wires which are in a bad condition are taken care of. Railway, on the other hand, have given their statement. They are saying that we are doing the audit, we are doing the inquiry and we would submit the report on 1st of July. But what about taking into account the condition, the present condition of the railway stations across the national capital. We are standing here at the KSR uh, Bangalore City Railway Station where you can see that, uh, you know, like we, also, we all know that there was an incident that happened at the national capital, New Delhi, uh, two days ago where a 34-year-old 30, uh, woman who lost her life due to electrocution, where I can tell you that, uh, yeah, there, there are few, uh, you know, wires, all, you know, that, is, that has been, uh, you know, that I can see here and I can, I can also show you that these kind of wires, uh, you, you can see that, you know, most of the passengers after they come out of the railway station they come here they sit over here so there are chances of uh, you know this kind of incident the incident which happened in Delhi there are chances of uh, the incident may or may not happen so before anything happen the you know the authorities have to make sure that they will uh, look into this uh, problems इस वक्त हम छत्रपति शिवाजी टर्मिनस के परिसर में मौजूद हैं ये रेलवे स्टेशन पर और हम आपको दिखा दें यहाँ पे किस तरीके के इंतजाम किए हुए हैं सबसे पहले तो मेरे वीडियो जर्नलिस्ट आपको बता रहे हैं कि क्या यहाँ पर किसी तरीके की खुली वायर है हम यहाँ पर एक घंटे पहले पहुँच गए थे हमने रिपोर्टिंग के दरमियान हमने देखा कि कहाँ पर ऐसी कोई आशंका है जहाँ पर कोई दुर्घटना हो सकती है हमें इस प्रकार की कोई चीज़ नहीं मिली केवल हमें एक यह बिंदु नज़र आया जो हम आपको अभी इस वक्त फोकस करके दिखा रहे हैं लेकिन ये भी आउट ऑफ डेंजर है मतलब यहाँ पे भी किसी प्रकार की अनहोनी नहीं होगी और यहाँ पर भी ये पूरी तरीके से सेफ है कुछ लोगों से हमने बात की उन्होंने इस तरीके की कोई इलेक्ट्रोक्यूशन की घटनाएं सामने आती हैं इस परिसर में तो नहीं बताया है खासकर रेलवे परिसर की बात की जाए लेकिन जिस तरीके से हमेशा ये डामाडोल जवाब रहता है कि ये रेलवे परिसर में नहीं आता या ये बी में आता है वो सारी तस्वीरें दूसरी ओर हैं जैसे हम कैमरा पैन करके आपको दिखा रहे हैं 
कई और यहाँ पर स्ट्रीट लाइट्स हैं कई और यहाँ पर वायर बॉक्स हैं वहाँ पर हमने देखा कि उनके भी पूरी तरीके से इंतज़ाम किए गए हैं वो भी बंद हैं तो पूर्ण रूप से तो यह कहा जा सकता है कि मुंबई की जहाँ तक बात करें रेलवे परिसर की बात करें तो यह नई दिल्ली जितना भयावह नहीं है हालांकि कहीं और सबोबंस में हो तो कहीं चूक ज़रूर हो सकती है इसकी आ, इसकी संभावना ज़रूर है लेकिन यहाँ पर दक्षिण मुंबई में छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज रेलवे टर्मिनस के पास से हम रिपोर्टिंग कर रहे हैं यहाँ पर हमें ऐसा कुछ नहीं नज़र आया Ila, my colleague joins me live on the broadcast. More inputs on this top story. Ila, of course, we did see our colleagues also um, conducting that reality check. But what is the latest that you're picking up in terms of uh, this case as well? We do know that the NHRC has also stepped in. Well, absolutely, the NHRC has sent a uh, notice to not just Railway Ministry but also Commissioner of Police and uh, the Chief Secretary of uh, Delhi. And right now, I'm at the same spot where this ha incident has happened in the morning of 25th. And uh, you can see right now the officials were there a while ago, and now the uh, maintenance work is underway. See, this is the passage. There is the taxi stand, and from that. taxi stand sakshi uh, came out and he, she was moving on this pavement and it was raining uh, heavily on that day so the pat hole in front of you which is still persistent and still has the water inside it was also there to save herself uh, from this pat hole sakshi was trying to move like this uh, when uh, around here she fell and she touched this particular pole where there was a wire a loose wire Well, and you can see uh, here here was the wire at this same spot and she touched this and uh, she got uh, the she got electrocuted and uh, as soon as she got electrocuted some of the civilians tried to save her but now family is saying that it is it was complete negligence from the side of authorities that they are going through such pain and a mother has been lost and children are also very much traumatized now nhrc has written uh, to the railway ministry as well as the commissioner of police as well as uh, delhi chief secretary and seeked a detailed report about the incident within 4 days and to uh, also give detailed information how it all happened who all are uh, responsible and uh, who uh, and why this uh, kind of incident has happened on uh, such a crowded railway uh, station pahar ganj which is one of the crowded railway station and uh, that too in the heart of for delhi near uh, cp and uh, new delhi and uh, in this particular uh, railway station there are a lot of people from uh, who comes daily who travels daily and now the authorities are here doing the maintenance and the question is why this audit why this report why these official from uh, railway ministry home ministry and the police was not there at the time when sakshi needed them and, and why there was no audit done before this incident ha has happened so that it could have uh, avoided it would have not been uh, such a case and you see these poles are having uh, wires and these poles are open poles these poles are just closed with a white sheet right now in front of us and uh, they, they they are maintaining these all poles today only when this incident has happened one lost has one life has been lost and was with and this whole traumatizing event was witnessed by both of her kids who are as little as 6 and they have to went through this trauma and no family seek is justice over to you Right, Ella. Thank you very much for joining us on the broadcast. Not only getting us the latest on that, but also continuing to track that story for us and getting that reality check, which we will, of course, continue to track here on Mirror. Now, but for the moment, we leave it to that and shift our.